that or not, but I'm trying to get this hoof wall to grow. This is not very well. Trying to get this hoof wall to grow best in line with these joints as we can. Um, the angular limb deformity, and so get this to go straight down. As you can see, they're already growing straighter compared to what she was first born with. That's why I've been trimming short on this side to try to get the bottom here to line up. So as this grows out, it doesn't continue to have a force to bend it out. And then the, uh, the little pads keep her from rolling sideways or back. So all the pads help with that so that she can't roll either direction or front or back. This foot's a little more severe. Yeah, this foot's much, much more severe. You can see. Yeah, it's it's had a lot more force on it. That's why these there's a lot of ridges here from all of us trying to correct it. But this one has a better chance of correction. Yeah, this one she should be able to have fairly normal movement. She's probably going to need a pad on this one for the rest of her life. Yeah, but our goal is function, so. Yeah. <laughs> all right. <laughs> and Leanne's kind of getting used to being held like this. Yeah, I'm not going to make sheep. Lamb.